Aston Neville here with FanRag Sports, joined by Chris Schubert. Big topic in the NBA playoffs right now is injuries. We can't seem to catch a break. Blake Griffin in particular, what does this mean for the Clippers moving forward? Well, they lose one of their more important players uh, in a series that has seemingly lost a lot of important players. The Jazz just got Rudy Gobert back, who seemed to be on an, a, uh, I almost called it an innings limit, a uh, minutes limit last night, playing at around 25 minutes. Uh, Gordon Hayward leaves the game with food poisoning. That doesn't seem to be an injury or a, an illness that's going to last uh, throughout the entire postseason, but this series in particular has seen a lot of injuries, and I wonder if maybe this is the last we've seen of Blake Griffin in L.A. Where do you think he's going to go? Well, that's an interesting one, and I am going to give a hat tip to Charles Barkley for suggesting this idea, but as soon as he said it, it made a whole lot of sense to me. Where did Blake Griffin go to school? Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Who needs help in Oklahoma right now? Russell Westbrook. Now, I don't know if their personalities will mix or they'll clash. or I don't know what that situation is like. But if the Thunder are really serious about keeping Russell Westbrook in Oklahoma City and making sure he doesn't flee to, let's say, the Lakers, I know that's a popular destination down the road, then they would be inclined to bring in talent to help him. Because right now, and I know as much people hate to talk about this, Russell Westbrook doesn't have any help. I mean, in the, no. in the last minute of that game uh, over the weekend, he needed help, and he doesn't have it on that roster. Blake Griffin could be that help. Well, I think we're going to be seeing Blake Griffin in a New Jersey next year.